Greetings, Entities and Guardians. My name is Hyper Himes, and welcome back to Kick Your Run Oven Break, where finally, with this new update in regards to Black Sugar Swan Cookie, that means the update of. Well, first of all, this are, it got updated, obviously, but they also updated the Peril and Paradise update, which now it's uh, Protect Desert Paradise. Which I say that, I mean Desert Paradise, because I suck at saying Desert Paradise without saying Desert Paradise, because it's so hard to pronounce the two with my stupid brain. Anyway, if you go here, it says, Huh, I was wondering when you were going to make it here. To believe a fledgling guardian would keep me waiting. Huh. I suggest you listen to what I tell you. So you want, so, and Sugar Swan is just right there still smiling. You want me to go ahead and just enter inside here where it says Peril and Desert Paradise. You want me to help you with your downfall. Sure, okay, let's go ahead and enter inside of it. Hello. Ha! Huh. Break, you darn thing! A cage like this is nothing for me! You're too loud, Gold Honey Cake Cookie. The bars in this cage are enchanted with some form of magic. Let me try to melt them with my flames. Great! You melt them, then I'll break them! You know, Red Panicata Cookie, I am really sorry for not believing you. In hindsight, there's no way Black Sugar Swan Cookie is our Sugar Swan. It took you this long to realize that? Let's break out of this cage and look around the castle. We must find eternal sweetness. She's really gave off the same energy as Sugar Swan. What could have caused that? The answer to that will be somewhere in this castle. Has anything of note changed since the Sugar Swan left on her journey? You have always looked after the Galaxy Lake Castle. I'm sure you must have noticed changes too, if there were any. I haven't noticed anything too different. Except Black Sugar Swan Kiki's arrival, I guess. And all this thing is making my head hurt. Let me finish breaking through these bars first. Uh <laughs> Thank you so much, Wind Archer Kiki. We would have never, we we never would have gotten away if you had to shot the honey webs with the arrows. That's right. The honey spiders attack would have left our dough in crumbles. Ruler of the spiders, what need is there for fights? When will oh, that will do neither side any good? The darkness that eats away at the desert paradise is not within us. That does not change that the honey web forest is falling to ruin. Is it so wrong to try and survive, Guardian of the Old Tree? I will ask you once again. Oh, ruler of the spiders, tell us what you know of eternal sweetness. It is a power that came from a distant land, long, long ago. I have heard that it is the very power that prolongs the desert paradise existence, while also bringing frigid winters upon it. What? What do you mean it causes these winters? Why? Isn't eternal sweetness supposed to be good? The amount of power required to halt time is bound to stagnate. This is the very reason why the breeze bought by the winters, by the sugar swans in return, wakes desert paradise from its winter slumber. Only the ruler of the birds may maintain the precarious balance between eternal spring and winter. That is the legend that was whispered to me by the spiders of the ancient as I lay dormant within my silken wig. The precarious balance between spring and winter. Does that mean that the sugar swan must return to restore balance to paradise? You are both correct and incorrect, Wind Archer Cookie. A crack has begun forming in a power we thought eternal. Our paradise may already be beyond returning to what it once was. No way! What can we do? Desert, the desert paradise is our home? I am still left with questions, but it seems as if we may not have time to ask a more detailed answer. Ruler of the Spiders, do you know, where the, the, do you know the whereabouts of the eternal sweetness? So many questions for such a small cookie. What do you offer in return? I may offer my favor in return for that small raccoon, perhaps. I'm not a raccoon! I'm a red panda! Wind, Wind Archer Kick, you, you have to say something! I am here to protect our paradise, not negotiate for favors. Will you not answer for the sake of the dessert animals, honey spiders, and all? Wind Archer Kick, he's right. We all need to work together. I am not fond of such idealistic ideas, but it appears I have no choice. Little spiders, would you pass on the news trapped in our webs? Well, those are some weird noises. Wow, look, Cubby. There are tiny little honey spiders coming from all over. From all over. And the big honey spider's eyes are sparkling. They almost look like marbles, and they're so pretty. There's no place impossible for my spiders to reach, which means there's no sight nor plight that occurs within desert paradise that does not reach me. What have you seen? Is there anything noteworthy? A poor, unfortunate bird coveyed the power within the castle and played tricks to get their wings upon it. While at first unable to make use of eternal sweetness as true power, they are growing stronger. If they are unable to be stopped, there will be no further. There will be no future to this paradise. Complete the missions here to gather paradise coins. Collecting these beautiful coins allow you to complete each step, and completing all the steps will let you proceed to the next stage. Now then, naive, 
or Nave. Nave, it doesn't matter, young guardian. It's time for to, it's time to go for a run. Oh, they're, they're calling me a naive young guardian, which they're telling me to run with Plebbing Sugars on Cookie at level 7. I'd rather not. I will only run at level 6, because that's all I'm going to offer to you. I don't think you told me to run with the magic candy. Wait, let me just ask. Now it costs 2. Now it costs 2. I could use the potions. Uh... How to this be seventh? Ah, oh, we're just gonna run at level six then. Uh, that, that, that's all we're gonna do for the upgrades. Yeah. Uh, so how do these videos work? If you're wondering, since we're just kind of starting up in this, uh, we're gonna be we did the first cutscene, so we're gonna be trying to complete stage one, and then the next video will complete stages two and three, and then stages four and five. Which who are the cookies we're gonna meet? Uh, it is. Uh, okay, I expected with cream, but fairy cookie. I kind of also expected, but also uh, cauliflower. Why cauliflower? I don't know. And I don't know if it's just me, but isn't weird? I don't know if it was always like this, but the fact that, like, there's a stamp and it's right over a uh, fairy cookie's wing. That kind of sounds painful. But I think that's just, uh, for... No, but that... Oh, no, wait, no, it's because it's see-through. Okay, now I understand. Okay, so let's go ahead and get a run on. I'm still not used to running with, uh, plumbing Black Sugar Swan, considering I still need to plumbing Magic Candy, which I might plan to, like, try and attempt to run, like, raid runs or something like that off camera to see if I can do any worth out of that. I don't know, but it's literally all I can kind of get going for me right now. So, that's all, because I, I can either do it by Surprise Bear or by playing a Raid Run. And the thing is, with Raid Run, it's not even a guaranteed chance. Because, let's be honest, if I do do it in Raid Run, let's be honest, I can get the legendary, like, magic uh, candy ingredient, but it might be for anyone else. It could be for Black Sugar Swan, but it also could be for Normal Sugar Swan. It could be for Xylotol Nova. It could be for Timekeeper. It could be for Plumbing Fire Spirit. It could be for any one of those legendaries, and I would have, like, no say in the matter. I would have to rely heavily on luck, and that's what kind of makes it unfortunate for me. At the very least, I miss, like, when, uh, I could have sworn before you actually had a higher chance to get the Magic Candy Ingredient back in, uh, Cookie Trials. Which is depressing now the fact that, like, that's not really a thing anymore because, uh, it's because they got rid of those, like, mystery, like, boxes that you would be able to obtain. Because that's the only one how you could obtain them. Through those little, like, mystery boxes that have four rarities of bronze, sh uh, like, bronze, silver, gold, and, like, rainbow. Or diamond, or crystal, or whatever the plug was. But, I don't know, still just unfortunate. But, I somehow already got five missions done out of this, which is pretty impressive. But I know for a fact we can do more, which is why suddenly we just got seven done. How the plug was I able to get through that? I'd really like to know. There's literally no plugging way I could have gotten through that. Like, there was just no way. It would have been, it would, it would either be, you get hit, or you fall. Like, there's, there's just no in-between. And the thing is, the sad thing is, my skill would have activated again if I was able to actually manage to land that. That is the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Only 200 million points. Oh, low-level legendary. It's not even low-level, it's mid-level, but in comparison to everyone else, the fact that it's low-level makes me so pained in the heart. The fact that I have to drop so much money on this just to get it to reasonably level while I'm trying to save all the plumbing money I have. It is so plebbing. Depressing, I swear. Let's just go ahead and get this over with once again. So I can go ahead and clear all this garbage up. Because, eesh. I just hate the fact that I have to run through this. And my Plumbing Sugar Swan is not at a good level. Okay, I think Whipped Cream Cookies are up ahead. Yeah, and of course Black Sugar Swan is going to meet with Whipped Cream. So why the Plub not? Whipped Cream Cookie, where are you? Come, show me your beautiful dance once more. I just finished practicing the dance you wanted to see. Perfect timing. Black swans, gather by the lake. Let us enjoy this enchanting midnight performance. Your dance grows more exquisite with each passing day. I can't help but applaud. I want you to open the next festival with this dance. It's all thanks to you giving me plenty of time to practice in peace. Actually, I was, I was thinking that I'd, I'd like to show my dance to the others as well. And why would you say such a thing? Who could possibly appreciate the pure beauty of your dance better than I? Your stage should be for me alone. Those who lack a sense of beauty wouldn't understand it anyway. But the Guardian Cookies were the first to see me dance here. I want to show them how much I improved, and I haven't seen them much lately, but... Then why waste your thoughts on cookies who do not care for you? Isn't it foolish to yearn for those who don't even think of you? Maybe they're just busy because so much has changed here, I... I still haven't found Black Sugar Duck either. If I could just go outside the castle and look for... Enough! I told you not to waste your thoughts on such nonsense. I may have lost my temper. Come, let's return to the castle. As for that little bird you spoke of, I may allow you to meet it someday. I wonder how everyone's doing. Are they alright? Most likely not. 
because I think by the time that you met Red Panicata and Gold Plumbing Honeycake are still inside the stuck in that castle. Buttershell Fox is still injured with Blue Slushy caring for them and the others. Uh, and only uh, Plumbing Red Panda and also uh, Plumbing Mate, well, like Buttershell Fox. No, nope, Buttershell Fox with that. I tried to Plumbing Lion Cub. Let's go with that Lion Cub and Plumbing uh, Red Panda and Wind Archer were contacting spiders. So, everyone's kind of in a bad state of mind right now, so hopefully you just with some more ease of running, which, by the way, at the end of this video, depending on how long the cutscene is, I might do, like, a little cheeky costume pull, which would be pretty cool, but, uh, right now we'll just have to play and wait and see, because, eesh, the amount of crystals I'm gonna have to dump, and also, like, potentially have to save, it's just too much to count. Like, just only to get to level 7, you gotta spend thousands of- just to even get one level. Even at its most basic form, you need to get Black Sugar Swan to like one level up. It would take you still thousands of gems. Thousands! And those are hard to come by. The most heat gems that you can get is either from the plumbing, uh, maybe the loot boxes, but that's specific for this update. But other than that, all you have is the Gem Exchange Center, which if you don't have any like VIP access or anything other than that, you have to go off the 8,000 gems that you're able to get like every like week. And that's, and that's not very much at all. Like the 8,000 gems every week. And there's also... Okay, there we go. I think that's the jump that I failed, was it? I don't even plumbing remember. But it's that. I did get a new high score somehow. But it's that. The plumbing surprise bait. Not the surprise bears, but I guess also the surprise bear, but that's rare. But there's also the plumbing uh, bear jelly things that you get whenever you run a certain distance. But other than that, that's basically about it. Which, by the way, we do, we do get a free whipped cream and a free whipped cream cookie pet, which is pretty good. Which I don't even think we have enough to finish at all. No, we do not. We still don't have an ohm. This hurts. Oh my gosh, I hate this so much. Is that enough now? I really hope that's enough because I don't want to have to go through this whole entire thing again. And if it's not, I'll be genuinely upset. Hey, that better be enough. Okay. You already completed the first stage. I lost track of my time admiring my reflection. Proceed to the next stage before you're too distracted by my beauty. I don't care about your beauty. I'm more careful about my plumbing rage at this point because you're making me upset just because of how much I got to spend just to make you good. I don't even think I did this much in regards to the normal Sugar Swan. Like, not black one. I'm just talking about when the Sugar Swan kicked you first release. Probably because I didn't care as much. But still, that hurts me. All are here to revere me and my tranquil garden. And yet, whipped cream cookie, why do you still look so somber? Sorry, I made a mistake in our duet. But, black Sugar Swan cookie, have you heard of how more of, how, how more of the dessert animals have been failing? They've been falling ill lately. I keep worrying that if my fen might fall ill somewhere... I, I can't focus. There you go, talking about that little duck of yours again. How many times do I have to tell you I'm looking for her for you already? Why are you wasting your time thinking about something like that? Can you not see the beautiful paradise I've laid out before your eyes? The joyous festival, the gorgeous decorations, and yet the only thing that leaves you your cr that leaves your crumbly dough is com It's just complaints. Is it truly a paradise? <sighs> is it truly a paradise if not everyone's happy? Is this paradise you're so fond of a paradise? For all? It, is, it, is it just for you? Silence! I will not accept this insolence. Not even if it's from you. Black sugar swan cookie. Remove yourself from my presence, and I would suggest not angering me any further. My apologies. I'll go look for my friend. There's no point. Such an ugly little duckling has no place in my paradise. <sighs> How can you sleep peacefully in a situation like this, gold honey cake cookie? Must be nice to be so laid back. Huh, it is ready to receive praise from you, Red Panda Kata Cookie. However, I'm simply resting to re regain my strength. Like you always say, even a bird's gotta get some good relaxation to be able to fly with such- with that much farther. I'm resting my dough for both of our six, huh? <sighs> That's not what I say. It's one- it's one must know when to withdraw in order to fly that much higher. It doesn't mean to rest all willy-nilly. It simply means even if you feel like you're falling behind, you're just preparing for the next step of your journey. But you may be right, Gold Honey Cake Cookie. I was getting too ahead of myself. Very well. Let us rest and then once again try spreading the bars of the cage. I did not think it's possible, but I suppose raw strength is one aspect you will never fall behind in. Just a bit more and I believe we can slip out. It was all thanks to our f it was thanks to your flames for making the bars weak and pliable. Huh, but I'll continue to do my best. What are you chirping on about, little birdies? Black Sugar Swan Cookie. Let us out of this cage this very moment. You are not our sugar swan. Hmm, how pathetic. You only just now realized that. It appears the sugar swan's guardians were not all that great after all. Who are you? 
What have you done to the sugar swan? Hmm, what did I do? I've absolutely done nothing. Yeah, I do believe I might just be able to do something now, though. Just think about it, Red Panda Cat Cookie. Everyone lives happily, even ever, in our paradise of my creation. Impossible. Your arrival has caused dessert paradise to wither and the dessert animals to fall ill. You really think we'll calmly go along with your plans? You really don't know how to look at the bigger picture, don't you? There are plenty of dessert animals out there who already, who already adore my paradise. Plus, why are you placing all the blame on me? All I wanted was for everything to be beautiful. I've never wished for anyone to fall ill, nor for paradise to wither. I will, however, save you all if you choose to follow my orders. I can make it so no one falls ill, and so the desert... So the dessert paradise blooms once again. Isn't that tempting? If truly wished for a paradise for all, this would not have happened in the first place. I'm one of the guardians tasked with protecting the sugar swan and this paradise as a whole. I would never serve a cookie like you who simply imitates her greatness. Hmm. Imitate? You think I'm imitating her? Name one thing where I'm lacking compared to her. Just one! I, I can't... breathe. Let me ask you this, little red bird. Just where is your great powerful sugar swan now? If she truly loved this dessert paradise, you would not think she would just return- Would she just return to save it? That's- But she's not here. She never is. It is you guardians who have protected this paradise. Yet you sit here perched day in and day out, waiting desperately for her to return, coming up with some stupid test to join your ranks. Who is there truly to save you if this paradise were to face true trouble? Or if they were to be overcome by a wing chilling cold? The sugar swan has her own duties to fulfill. This is our duty as guardians is to do what we can to support, support her in completing hers. Is that so? It doesn't seem like that to me. If I were her, I would just be here by your side protecting you myself. I would not allow my precious cookies to get entrapped in honey webs, nor would I let them wander through the frost cave and become popsicles. And I would never give them false dreams by simply giving them a glimpse of my beautiful face before leaving them behind to despair on their own. I would look back to them and- How do you know about the dessert guardian test? Who- is who are you? Isn't the seeing such a shocked look upon your usually stoic face? I can almost see your dough trembling like well-shaken pudding. I will enchant you and win over your hearts with my beauty, and that will ensure you never think about your sugar swan ever again. Why does that sound so familiar? Black, Black sugar swan cookie, you you couldn't be. Red panicotta cookie, look! Black sugar swan cookie's glowing, I I recognize that glow. I remember now, that, that light within the castle disappeared after the sugar swan left for a journey. Okay, so that's fantastic. So apparently... They both recognize what that plumbing glow was that the Sugar Swan has, which, considering what we've seen literally as the update happened, like the little opening scene before you get to play the game, right, when you update the game, and also the animation that plays once Black Sugar Swan runs out of energy, I am kind of pretty sure you can understand who the plumbing true identity of the Black Sugar Swan is. I'm just taking a wild shot in the dark, and, but I'm not going to say anything. I'm going to wait until the whole story is revealed. Unless if I should. It's the plumbing duck. It's literally, it's that plumbing duck. That makes sense. That's why they're not going to like go ahead and find them because that is the duck. Anyways, with that being said, if you enjoyed the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it and also share the video with your friend if you enjoy my cookie run content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe and also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. And also down below in the description, you'll see links to all of my social media, including a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get the cookie run YouTube staff for absolutely free. There's a link to my Discord server called the Hype Me's Hub. There's a link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel. And there's also a link to my Kofi where for just $1 a month, you can see exclusive content they wouldn't normally see in this normal YouTube channel. But above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next video. Hail the Hype Me's.